check this big boy out here. This is from Diamond Select, Diamond Select Toys, the Gallery Diorama, It Chapter 2, Pennywise in a Box. I apologize for the glare, but it's okay because we're about to remove it from the box momentarily while we get a closer look at it. Now, this is obviously bigger and heavier than the other ones that I've previously done on this channel. The only one that might rival it, if I can pronounce that right, rival, rival it, is Cthulhu, who uh, was, of course... A whole different animal than this there's the side of it pennywise in a box which is a pretty cool scene from the movie it chapter two brought to life sort of so to speak in diorama form that's what he's going to look like when we take him out of the box and this is what it says about him here sculpted by rocco tartamella i wish i could pronounce his name right because he has done all of these pennywise it things that we have covered so far also, big shout out to UPS, who totally jacked up the side of my box when they sent this to me. But, you know, I guess they have a hard enough job, and it's not like it's going to matter. Because most of the time you display these, you're going to display them outside the box anyway. Get the side view of what he looks like inside there. But let's take him out and see what it looks like in person, so to speak. Well, here is what we're dealing with outside the box. Uh, not as heavy as I thought it might be, to be honest with you. It was uh, actually quite light, as you can see how easily I move it around there. Of course, it's, you know, got a big hole in the middle. This part is hollow, but it's cool stuff. If you remember from the movie, I believe that is a perfect rendition of what you got in the movie. Go down here slowly so we can check it out. And, you know, this is something different. Of course, the lid doesn't shut, although it does have a latch as if it did. There is the art there. Like I said, the detail on these. Are just amazing in my book i mean just look look how cool that is turn it to the side it says pennywise the dancing clown on the side as we go down with it very good job on the sculpting here like i said there's the long lanky flattish hands on this of course the pennywise the dancing clown there like i said the lid's thin there really ain't much to it but it doesn't it doesn't close, which is fine. I think something like this doesn't need to close because it kind of defeats the purpose of what it's supposed to be ultimately to the side there. This side, more the same as the last side, but this one has a handle, and yes, it does rotate a bit. So you got that for whatever reason, but it, it, it does it. And you come back around, and there it is. Pennywise, the dancing clown, in his pop-up box like a jack-in-the-box box but you know there's there's all kinds of cool stuff you can do with this franchise with this series based on like the movie and i think this was a pretty good option for something to pick and do something with because once again just look at that that's creepy there's nightmare fuel for all you people that's really legit terrified of clowns out there <laughs> but i just like this one a lot like this one here i, I probably like the solo ones better but you know the, the basic figures are just the Pennywise character but if you have to depict a scene this is not a bad one to go with like I said it's got the the lid it's got the latch but it does not close but it doesn't really need to so this is from Diamond Select Toys I believe it's on one of those $50 deals uh, which is good if you like this stuff I personally like them it's gonna go good on my desk next to the other two Pennywises and the Cthulhu that I have and the other diorama that I'm going to be reviewing next. And that will conclude our dioramas for now with the next one. And this will conclude our Pennywise ones for sure. But that's what that is right here. It's Pennywise. It's Diamond Select. Get it wherever you get this cool stuff. And just put that out somewhere and give somebody a good wholesome nightmare or spook if they don't like clowns.